<clears throat> what is good guys it's Amor94 again and welcome back for another unboxing video so without further ado I'm both proud of it and not proud of it because this is my very first uh, Bandai Master Grade which is the Full Armor Gundam Gundam Thunderbolt version Verka and that's a really long ass name and as you can see here um, of course uh, this is just a celebration or a spoiler for me I just want to spoil myself because uh, the channel's running for over a year now and really thank you so much guys but without further ado let me just show you if I can the side of the box here you will see the uh, the full armor Gundam not in full armor mode yet you will see the very nice core fighter really unique design and you will see the rest of the accessories here really wow and onto the other side you see uh, some poses of the uh, full armor Gundam there and front and the rear view and some more gimmicks and without further ado again let me just show you the runners but the manual first of course starting off with the manual just a typical of work uh, manual and really thick because you really need to do a lot in this uh, kit and just to start off not gonna talk about that much onto the kit itself just want to show you what are the contents of the uh, manual itself you see EU flaming there and the anime version I mean at uh, the anime artwork of the uh, full armor Gundam you will see runners here just gonna skim through it some more instructions down to the head onto the body I mean the torso and the arms then we're gonna go to the uh, foot I mean the feet and the legs and going up onto the waist some more instructions from here and there not really gonna show you that much you get the point it's just a master grade accessories and of course the full armor Gundam itself and you will see instructions on putting on the stickers and the decals and that's pretty much it really nice design here typical simple but beautiful now we're gonna start off with the uh, of course the runners starting off with plate A you will see uh, this more like not a blood red this is more like maroon than uh, gray clear uh, green and the yellow just a really crisp design and next would be of course plate B you don't only get one plate B you get two plate B's and this is uh, not gray actually this is more like uh, brownish uh, design and this is more onto the inner frame itself and of course you will get not only one but two plate C's here also the same color as the uh, plate B and next would be a uh, plate D starting up with the off-white color scheme this is more like a uh, with a bluish hue and you will see the interchangeable fingers there the part of the uh, accessory this is not part of the shield yet and for the cannon onto the backpack and next we would have uh, two plate E's same color again you will see this is the leg portion uh, same plate here really nice design I'm really excited to build this kit and next would be uh, for the shields of course plate F and a part for the backpack and the propellant tank here and of course not only one plate F you get two plate F's and next for the uh, next plate next up would be plate G and this is more like of a navy blue design here or a color scheme I mean you will see a part this is a uh, more parts onto the uh, full armor itself some parts here might be onto the backpack or uh, some parts from here and there and I think this is from the back itself of the full armor Gundam just a single plate G next would be uh, plate H two plate H and of course uh, same color with the uh, plate G and color orange or more like a yeah orange a typical orange a plate eye you get two plate eyes of course instead of stickers uh, like from the high grade you get uh, plastic parts for the color separation onto the shield itself and some more missiles inside the full armor next would be a very big J1 going back to the inner frame color which is more like brown instead of gray and uh, not only for the inner frame more parts for the accessories like the double barrel and the uh, five shot missile next would be a uh, J2 I just uh, repeat uh, parts for uh, J1 just a uh, little bit parts there and in there and next again with the marine maroon color K1 um, basically the shield itself some more parts onto uh, the thrusters 
and really nice this is a really nice design of the vent and of course another one which is a K2 uh, it's quite similar with K1 but uh, some part uh, most of the parts here were repeated and of course for a Verka kit this is quite surprising because I know uh, majority of the Verka kits doesn't have uh, doesn't provide uh, poly caps uh, correct me if I'm wrong but uh, yeah it's a good thing that it has poly caps for a very brick kit and of course beam sabers it's just that the beam saber here is quite warped I'm not really uh, complaining that much but uh, it's warped and finally for the plate a stand it's a good thing that they provided a stand and I hope that the uh, full armor Gundam itself I mean the stand can handle the full armor Gundam itself. Now going on to the uh, plates of course we do have stickers and decals. For the stickers of course a very small foil sticker sheet. Uh, maybe this is just for the uh, black parts inside the thrusters of course for the eyes and some uh, for the uh, lenses or the sensors of the accessories on f and for the forehead camera and the back. And that's basically for the foil stickers and for the decals really big set of decals here not really that big compared to other Verka kits but there are a lot of uh, options here to uh, put the uh, pinstripes there and the EFSF uh, logo and onto the back you will see this one uh, I forgot what it is called but this is more like a rubber plastic uh, that should be uh, covering the joints of the Gundam itself so that's basically it for the unboxing so that's basically it for the unboxing of the uh, Master Grade 100 scale Full Armor Gundam Gundam Thunderbolt version Katoki. It's just that uh, that's really a mouthful and I'm really excited to build this one. It's just that uh, I don't have any time yet but uh, as soon as possible I will finish this one right away. And thank you so much guys for all the support. I hope we get bigger. And thank you so much for Zach Aurelius again. It's just a really... Uh, a big thing for me to have your support onto my end and again the for more unboxings of uh, reviews vlogs of course go ahead and subscribe so that's it peace